we're back with another piece of mail art here from Deb Nikos in Bangor, Pennsylvania. A lovely envelope. The High Valley, Pennsylvania is where it got mailed out. It says happy holidays, so that's an indication of how long it's been since I received this and I've been waiting to video the opening of it. It has a stamp here of a Western Metal Lark, one of my favorite birds. And this envelope is just, it's super cute with little trailers and trees with a tree with a swing in it, tire swing. So cute. All right, let's break it up and see what we're getting in here. Just wanna make sure I'm not cutting anything integral. These are um, kind of like mini add-in pass um, objects, I suppose you could call them. So I've got dates on here of receipts, people receiving them, and then um, augmenting them and then sending them off. Uh, someone added some vegetable stamps and ice cream stamps. And so, um, United Eternal Network celebrating 25 years of excellence in mail art. Currency for you to alter, create, depending on its state when you receive it. Carry it with you a while or pass it along, but once you're done with it, please mail it to ex posto facto down in Hearst, Texas. And looks like I've got some collage material here, or maybe a good, I mean, they're gift labels, but maybe they could be um, turned into some collage material. Beautiful images of cacti and succulents on here. Um, this, again, is like an interesting uh, artifact that could be easily turned into collage material. Noctambulist. What's a noctambulist? It's a sleepwalker. I've never heard that term before. Learn something new every day. And so it looks like it's a card from like a spelling deck for spelling bee, like the bee honeycomb, yeah. So it's like a spelling bee practice card. Noctambulist. Couple more collage items here. Collage material. It looks like, it says player's cigarettes on them and it looks like people from history HMS Calcutta, HMS Black Prince. Hmm, curious. I wonder what those are. All right, oh, looks like an add and pass. We've got some notes on here. Blake Higgins is no longer interested in add and pass apparently <laughs> and then we've got uh, some stickers here 
These almost look like homemade stickers. Hmm, what should we do with this? We got some fancy washi tape and then a piece of text behind all of these collage items. Okay, very interesting. It looks like it's been to New Mexico, Omaha, Nebraska, Bangor, Pennsylvania, Tucson, Arizona, and it looks like it started out in Rhode Island. Well, now we're in Oregon. Okay, well, thank you, Deb, for sending me something new to open and share. And on to the next video. Um, if you are interested in mail art, visit iuoma.org, I think. It's the International Union of Mail Art. That's a good place to get started. Also, you can check out my website, dispersalcollective.com, where Jason Berlin and I occasionally post events and um, other ways that you can participate in mail art. Thanks, everybody.